Hey folks, I had this question come in twice this week. Uh, we loaned money to two investors who bought uh, both properties were in the high uh, 700s in the San Jose area. And both of them asked me, should I use a licensed contractor and get a licensed contractor or should I use just a regular handyman? And that is a great question and here is what I would say. And this is important. If you are doing things that require a, a permit to be pulled, uh, and it's non-negotiable that a permit may, must be pulled, i.e. you're going to do a foundation, you're going to do framing, you're going to add a bedroom, you're going to add a bathroom, you're going to get into roofing. If you're going to get into major rehabilitation, I think there's no question you need a licensed contractor and pull a permit. No question about it. If you're going to do a minor to moderate rehabilitation of the property that primarily focuses on cosmetic, there's a little bit of gray area there. Because if you enter the wall, it's supposed to be a permit. If you remove the toilet, it's supposed to be a permit. But really, we don't recommend that you pull a permit to remove a commode. And if you're going to enter the wall just to replace an outlet or put up a lighting fixture, we don't really recommend you pull a permit. So the advice is this. Even though technically you might need a permit, our advice is that if it's minor to moderate cosmetic repairs, stick with a handyman. They're going to be a third the price of a, of a licensed contractor. And, and they're going to get it done quicker and faster. And don't pull permits. If you're going to get into major construction, that's going to involve major componentry, then absolutely you should get a licensed contractor. My advice to all beginners and intermediates, very critical, stay with primarily cosmetic fixers. You can get your product at Home Depot, you can get your product at Lowe's, you can get it from the pro desk there at a reduced price, you can get in and out of the properties relatively quickly without a lot of hassle. I will tell you this, with a licensed contract employing permits, it's very, very hassle oriented today, especially with the pandemic. City and county offices are closed, working remotely, they're short-staffed. Getting permits through that process is turning to be very, very difficult. My advice to anybody right now is stay away from major componentry that's going to require a permit. You've got to get a licensed contractor, very difficult to find right now. You're going to have to pull permits, that's difficult. And you're dealing with county, state, and local agencies that are working remotely that are taking much, much longer to get things through the channel than would otherwise take. So. That's your fix and flip tip for this Friday. Have yourself an awesome weekend. I'm going to go spend some time with the wife and kids and take them out to dinner. I hope you do something fun too. Thanks again for watching.